So Chisi can literally do whatever she wants with her magic. Like, the limit is up to her imagination. We saw what she did last time. And Ellie specifically said she can do whatever she wants. But it's forbidden. Why? The rules of this world. Not just because of the, you know, the damage that her body receives whenever she uses so much magic as a slave beggy. Are there other things that's involved? I'm not really sure. But goddamn, we saw just a hint of what she can do. I hope she pops up in the future episodes too. Let's begin today's reaction though. Oh, a little Chisi belly button action. This anime doesn't really do much fan service, but there, there's some moments, I guess, like the bath scene in episode one. <laughs> woof, 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 woof. Oh, I was so happy. I just had to jump on your back. She's so adorable. Why is he being so depressed? I thought... True, you can just barge in. Who cares? I bet he'd let you. Just open it. That's where Elias would be sitting. Hello. Hi. I love her. She doesn't say much, but she's she's I love her so much. Also, we keep going back from silver and silky. What what I don't know what to call her, man. Bye. She just kick us out after giving us clothes? What what what? <laughs> um okay. Then go play outside. For a change, please come back before it gets dark. Okay. She gave us some money and kicked us out. What, what, we can just do whatever we want? She's not taking us, uh, you know, making us go grocery shopping? Hey, it's the, it's the lady that was like, gave us the crystal thing. And then the whole room just got engulfed in those crystals. And I forgot that guy's name. It's a little trap fairy. Not here for him. I'm here for you. <laughs> kind of, kind of cold, but <laughs> honest. Because we still haven't made the the staff with Nevin's branch. Would she be the one that would make it for us? Yeah, you have people to rely on now. Also, yeah, you got like the power of neighbors and everything. If we use the power of different neighbors instead of our own inherent power, then we wouldn't be so tired all the time. Because in the previous episode when she popped up, that was all her own power. Even the cleansing, that was her own power, right? School? Is there a school for mages? I don't think so. We're a rare breed. Uh, yeah, I, school, huh? I never really... It, is it like a magic academy? That'd be pretty fun. Yeah, I mean, she's just big chilling. I don't think there's any goal, to be honest. Mm, damn, it hits a little bit too close home. But... She's just kind of avoiding that topic. And I don't think it's a very good idea that she keeps on, like, the only reason for her existence is that it's Elias right now. I mean, it's it's a great thing that Elias is, like, helping her out. But the fact that she doesn't... I'm not sure if she still values her own life. And... Shit's getting way too real for her. I think you meant that. Subconsciously. But... You can you can tell like this is all true. That's a lot of boobs, but yeah, I, I'm sure that character development will come in the future. But she's right. We are just kind of avoiding that topic. Can't believe she actually punched the wall in there. <laughs> Holy shit! Didn't even pay Elise a visit. <laughs> I mean, it was all for Chise, but you know, Elise is bedridden right now. Bye bye. Hey, she called us Robin too. Remember how um, the fairy king Oberon did? And someone mentioned that Robin is a reference to Chisei's like bird-like red hair, different bird, something, something like that, right? I think we just need some time to heal. It's okay. We're taking baby steps forward. You know, ad admitting that you have a problem is the first step to progress. This isn't alcohol anonymous, but you know, I, I think she'll get there. Yeah, we're bonding. Did you like that when we, you know, elbowed the wall when it shit got too real? Oh. Ruth is so adorable. And like, he has all the features of like, the qualities of a dog, right? But like, the fact that Ruth can speak his mind also and converse with Chisei in like that dog-like way, it's so nice. It's actually so precious. So, uh, what do we do with the money? Them gifts. I wonder if Silky had any expectations. Is she mute? She never talks. And she made a noise there, but 
Open it. Open it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh. Oh, it's being a little naughty. It's too dark though. What's in What's going on here? Um. What is this thing? It's way too dark for me to see. Can't control my body. His voice is quite calm. Cheesy's not that scared, I don't think. I can't see what's going on, bro. Like, ah, fuck, it's hard. It's, I, I can't see anything. It's at least in a different form, though. But Cheesy's not scared at all. Embraces him even now. Because I'm cursed sounds like a kind of like an underhanded comment to help you. Wait, so he got the hammer out. Oh, Elise is like drooling on us. Are you trying to eat us? What is this? That's mom's line. Did you see Elise there? It looked like he wanted to like chomp us. He was like salivating all over us. Huh? Did he go hide in the shadows? Did he just leave? Left a note. Oh, Ruth was there the entire time. Did Silky beat the shit out of Elias with the hammer? What's going on? He just disappeared mid, like, just nighttime? Uh, oh, went to the church? What's up, Simon? Yes, but Elias isn't. Where is he? Whoa, he transformed. It smells fake. Yeah, why, why, why did you change forms just now? Okay. But it smells fake. Because hmm. church? I don't know. Something you remember what the, the fairy queen said? The false god or something? <laughs> Bye. If you don't know, then you were god. Yeah, we weren't here for you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hmm. Simple gramps. What? What was that look? What, what did Chisei do that? Whoa, oh, that's a lot of ass. Holy shit. That's a lot of ass. Um, I'm interested in what's on your shoulders, man. The queen. The, yeah, we can see you. Bazongas, man. Bazongas that could rival Titania. Titania. Liana and Sue. Vampire. Huh. My god, this... Holy shit. Holy shit. Hmm. But if she's also a fairy, then... <laughs> you know, if you pull the hair of the back of a girl like that... Mm. <laughs> I wasn't the response that I was expecting, though. <laughs> Them tits are heavy. Oh? Yeah, did you write it recently? Do we have time? It's a short story. Come on! This old man's so bored. Come on! Oh, never mind. We're just... Never mind. We're just not that educated, huh? I mean, she didn't go to school that much, I guess. So, I, I don't know how that works. A love story. Oh, maybe it's about Joel and his, like... Past wife, probably. This vampire is just by his side always, just right by him. I'm kind of jealous. Because if she gives him talent that he need, she need to suck his blood, and then she didn't. He would just say he'd die or something. Uh, yeah, why are you haunting him? Yeah, hey, what's going on here? The story about them? Joel and the vampire? Much younger, Joel. Hello. They can see each other? But... You don't want to show on Come on! But you're still sticking with them, though. Hmm. Oh, sounds like you care about him a lot. Oh. But I'm kind of confused. Can Joel see her? I mean, at that moment, in the past memory of hers, it looked like he did. Isn't it called love? Yeah. Yes. 
<laughs> yeah, I just realized he just took, took a nap in front of us. So for a second, he did see her, but I guess he doesn't see her anymore. No, there she is, dude! So why can he see her now? What's he looking at? <laughs> Definitely her face. I'm not, I'm not saying you know, her, you know, her entire body just like, oh, what are you going for? Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, like, honk, honk! Why though? Why was he able to see? Huh, slave baggies can allow vision to other people? He's not my... Hey! Still a kiss! Is he... Suddenly the mood changed. Oh, okay. That's a lot of smooches though. I thought she I thought she sucked her blood or something for a second, but that wasn't it. Elias, what are you doing? The f what? It looks like he just drowned and came out of the water. What's going on, man? He should be fine, right? He doesn't look too fine. I, I don't know, man. Hello. Well, what are you doing, man? Oh, there was a note though, yeah. Probably not. Open up, come on. Yeah, that'd be good for the Lord. Like, what is open up to us, man? What's going on? I guess he has it in his own, like, insecurities, too. But maybe she doesn't want that. Come on, open up more. Oh. You know, Ellie is pulling all this shit. Kind of makes this relationship bond a little bit more now. Because of a moment like this. Yeah. Actual turmoil. Will you answer? Hey, at least he's, you know, saying, like, I'll do it. Let's just give me some time. Hey, both sides are kind of, you know, mending. Oh. <laughs> Ruth's just listening behind the entire time. It's like, you kind of third wheeling hard, huh? Oh? The fu- Huh? Who are you? Uh, looks like a seal. It's a seal, right? Echoes. That's the dragon lord, right? No, the- Yeah, that's the dragon dude. Huh? A dragon appeared. Okay, we're going back to Dragonland. Well, this is an episode of Chise and Ellie's trial, both trying to be honest with their feelings, trying to open up, but goddamn, I was too distracted by the vampire. Holy shit. Honk, honk. Oh, relax, relax. Going back to the Dragonland. Did we get the branch of Nevins to make a staff out of? Is that still gonna happen? And the topic of school. Is there a mage academy? Wouldn't that be sick if you could go, you know, socialize with other mages and there's like a tournament arc or something? But probably not in this series. But hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please subscribe and check out the other videos and playlists on my channel for even more content. And until next time, take care.